Uh, how are you doing, mates? Silverfire here today. And today, I'm playing some Nautica. I'm gonna do a little something a little bit different this time around. I'm gonna try to roleplay this game. So, if you hear me going in and out of character, that's why. Now, I'm gonna say this real quick before I start. I suck in horror game in survival games, so yeah, this ought to be interesting. <clears throat> so, with that said, and with everything going on, let's get this started, shall we? Right, I forgot about that. Survival. Alright. Get to the skate pod now. Go, 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 go. Down. Yeah. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on, hurry up. <sighs> there. Oh, jeez. Uh. Ah, oh, that's not good. Oh, that is not good. Oh, shit. All the pods on fire! Come on, go, go, get up, get up, get up. Take it out, take it out, take it out, take it out. Whew. Okay, come on, work. Load up, you slow. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal <laughs> outcome. This PDAD has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay, water and Got a nutrients block. Okay, so I should be alive for at least a couple of days. Maybe. Alright. Okay. Alright, so crash landed. <sighs> Dang it. Hyperator. Okay, everything seems to be working. Hello? Hello? Dang it. Radio's busted. I'm not calling for help for any time soon, that's for sure. Oh, hello. Oh, jeez. Oh, Stuck on an ocean world? The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Great. What's that over there? Anyways. Okay, so we're on an ocean world. Wow. 
This place is amazing. I mean, it's crazy, but still, it looks amazing. is an essential oh. component of all powered oxygen. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. <gasps> okay, going back in there. Ah, titanium. Well, it's a metal, anyways, from the ship. back towards the escape pod. Oxygen. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ah, medicine. That's going to become handy later on. get myself a scanner. <laughs> Need to make a battery. Alright. Alright, I need some cop- I got copper. Or, I can find some copper. Just need acid mushrooms. <clears throat> okay. Back into the water we go. Guess and this is it. This place is beautiful. Now I need copper. This thing seems been real popular. Oh, hello. We didn't have anyone else to come with us. But for right now, we need to worry about survival. New blueprint acquired. Alright. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from okay. salvage technology and to record alien biological data. Okay, so I need silicon rubber. How do I make silicon? Silicon right, rubber. From creep. From creep vine. C clusters. Okay. Where the heck is that? Alright. Alright, scan. 
of scan complete. Vital signs normal. Continuing to monitor. Okay, so it seems like everything's fine. For now. Uh, excuse me. Oh, what are you? Oxygen. <sighs> okay, that was close. Where's rubber? The, the creep vine. Oh, is that it? Where are those? Hmm? Oh, it's kind of like Sonic the Hedgehog there. Creep fine. Life on this planet <sighs> grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Ah, crap. Print yeah, yeah, I know. Jeez. Get back into the ship. Eat up. And work on a few things. Cave sulfur? Where can I find cave sulfur? I guess it's in a cave. Yeah, I need another battery in order to... I need two batteries in order to do that. Alright, let's get another rubber, just in case. Alright, let's eat up. So everything's down. Uh, oh my lord, that is a big moon. Well, it could be a planet. Let's see. Oh, so this planet has two moons? I should have really read up on the information before I decided to join up on this mission. The heck is that? Oh, it looks like a storm. Well, that looks safe. Alright. Better head back inside. <laughs> Still smoky in here. Okay, so I need to repair a lot of things. Alright, so for now, I'll put this stuff in here. Survival knife could be handy. Uh, yeah, I got a spare rubber on me, so let's make a knife. 
Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Well, yeah. <laughs> Still got it. <sighs> Come on, son. Show up. I'm not going down there until... Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core. Wait, what? Sustained during planet fall. Oh, no. You mean to tell me that that ship's gonna blow up? Well, that ought to be a sight to behold. Let's try it. Come here. Got you. Alien life forms may have unexpected applications. Optimizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Oh, hey. I can make water from these guys. Well, that's good to know. And they seem to be more or less easy to catch, so... Ah, sun's up. Let's get to work. Alright, what am I trying to build? Oh, right. I'm trying to build the repair thing. I wonder if that system I found earlier would be considered a cave. Heck are you guys? It's some kind of jelly? Oh. Hello. Well that's kind of rude now, isn't it? Okay. Still normal. Oxygen. Yeah, yeah. I think this is it. Yeah, this was the cave I was in earlier. Better grab up some oxygen real quick. Okay, here we go. Egg's that? Some kind of egg? Oh, it's you thing. It's these things again. in there to see if that little guy left anything. Oh, that's where he came from. Aha! Detecting sulfur deposits in the local cave systems. Sulfur is an essential component of the repair tool. Yeah! Now I got sulfur. But great, I can't make firearms or anything. Okay. Oxygen. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, repair tool is now made. Okay. Life 
Support secondary systems online. All right, the power's on. Diagnostic and outputting results to data bank. All right, power's on. That's good. And radio's on. All right. Radio online. Broadcast and emergency distress signal. This is Aurora. Distress signal received. Rescue operation will be dispatched to your location in nine. Oh. Nine. 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 Hours. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods. Yes! Yes! Oh, that is a good news. Okay, so... We're good. Let's make some fins. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Oh, good thing. Okay, so... Okay. <sighs> okay. Let's check over here. Watch myself. Okay. So let me see if I can find any parts to us. Any materials. More salvage from the ship. This is going to help me in the long run. Hmm. It's in here. Nothing, just a shortcut. Oh, I should probably oxygen. get oxygen. Still not invincible. guys again. Swim, 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 swim. Ow! Those guys are jerks. Okay, it's got a C part of half of a C glide in there. 
See if I can find any more. for those containers. I assume that there are any more. I mean, there should. There was, a full sh there was a ship full of people, so I highly doubt that they all just only had stuff for one person. Let's see. Oxygen. Ugh. I need to work on it, aren't OC tank. You know what? Let's try to work on air tank. me. Okay. Let's see if I can find any more containers. There's one. 30 seconds. Yeah, yeah. Where's the opening? Get it, get it, get it. Yes! We got a sea glide. New blueprint acquired. Oxygen. more water here just shortly. essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. Okay. So now I got that. All I just need is a battery. Which is 
just... I just need a copper. That should be easy. Do I have copper here? No, I do not. <sighs> I should probably drink something. Wait, I got a radio signal, looks like. I'll listen to it as soon as I get back. Okay, got copper. Sea Glide. Yes! The Sea Glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. This is Life Pod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Rendezvous? Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. There's a rendezvous? Signal location uploaded to PDA. <laughs> we're not the only ones! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Uh... Ah, it's over there. Two hundred and ninety-eight meters. Yeah, I can make it. Huh? Well, it works. there. What? It's already down? Okay, better check for survivals. For survivors. Looks like our sea glides took in some serious extensive damage. The hell? Integrating new PDA data. How broke in there? It's not one of us. Oxygen. Zazi from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't want us this might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. What the heck? That's even further. 
I have to help him. Caution. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core. Wait, what? May result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. What? The ship is about to blow up. Okay. Head on over there. Let's help whatever's there. It doesn't have a uh, room for seconds. Come on. Please be there. Please. The hell is that? Oh. Local scans show a nearby cave entrance, depth 90 meters, leading to an unknown environmental biome. 30 seconds. The hell happened? Integrating new PDA data. Oh. Short range scans suggest this biome supports extensive biodiversity and connects to a number of small cave networks. And there goes the last of my food. New creature discovered. What? Thirty seconds. New creature discovered. Few things I can cook. Well, whatever hit them, it's long gone. Probably egg weird or stuff in my day. Okay. Drink. I don't need the food now. I could probably patch myself up.
with this knife. Alright. Now I need to find another part of that sea glide, was it? Pathfinder tool. Oh, that would be uh, uh, useful. I think I need one of these, uh... Habitational builders I could probably use. The ship is still intact, for the most part. Maybe if I can repair it, I can get it, the ship going again. I think the, uh... Over here. Looks like part of the ship there. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. <sighs> Cargo's not opening. Still. <laughs> Thirty seconds. Looks like something was in here. Oxygen. Ah. Uh. Hey, are you? Reef 
back. Jesus. This thing is huge. Is there more to this ship? At this part of the section of the ship? Well, there is. Should probably hurry. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. 30 seconds. Integrating new PDA data. 30 seconds. Yeah. Jeez, I need to make a bigger oxygen tank, I guess. seconds. anything more for us here. Vital signs stabilizing. Need more water. Chip. 
power cell and battery well that was quick congratulations survivor you have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500% <laughs> data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. discovered. cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Well, that's good. Oh. There. Oh, I dropped... I dropped the peeper! the giant moon again. But yeah, other than the glow of the ship and the two moons and whatever biolucent uh, bio life is on this planet giving me light, there is not a whole lot of light. Oh boy. Mitch, what did we get ourselves into? Warning. Huh? Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Two hours? Oh, shite. Okay, okay, okay. Uh. Personal. Equipment. Uh. Let's see. Glass, titanium, and silver. I 
got the titanium. And the glass. cave from earlier. What was that cave? Find that ship again. Ah. Yeah, there you are. back up. Go back down. They said that there was supposed to be a cave nearby. Salt. 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Look at this. Thirty seconds. Yeah, I need way better oxygen before I start doing this. So, we kind of know where the caves is. We need silver. something.
still need silver. I'll check the cave here shortly, but... This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora D. Reed. Sunbeam? Over. Yes! Nothing but vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease, send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Yes. Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's gonna have us blowing our credits running errands for Altera. See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime. Yes! Oh yes! Yes, 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 yes. Sunbeam, sunbeam, sunbeam. Do you hear me? Hello. Okay, that was a short break. Sunbeam, do you hear me? My name is, well, most people call me Max, but I'm passenger five from the ship Aurora. Ship went down and is about to go nuclear. I need your assistance as fast as possible. Okay, that shit gets sent out. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go towards that cave I didn't really want to go into. This one.
Oh, I found gold. <laughs> I would be rich, but it's not a whole lot. Thirty seconds. Yeah, you better run. Oh, hello. Oh, he brought friends. He brought friends. Too close. Far too close. <sighs> too close. Quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state. 18 minus 10, oh, 9, 8, shoot. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Oh! Uh, yeah, I'm not going back that direction. Goes the guy counter. Good. Okay, so I need lead, wherever I can find that at, and uh, fiber flesh, which I know how to make okay, with the uh, fine samples from earlier. So let's go get some vine samples, come back, then we can go looking for lead. So we need to get two more fine samples. Then some lead. Try searching this area for lead. Oh, that's a piece of 
the hole. <gasps> Got another signal. I'll check it as soon as I can find some metals. What's that? Oh. Is that what you, one of you guys? seconds. What is that noise? Oxygen. This is Sunbeam again. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. Yes. I didn't know how bad... how many of you... Like, I didn't know. Okay. We're now en route to your location. Yes! We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. Yes, Sunbeam! What else can I say? The only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. And I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. Okay, so we got someone coming for us. That's good. So that little nuclear detonation helped us out a little bit. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. dream. <sighs> I think I'm gonna go back to sleep. Thank you guys all for watching, if you all were watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like this kind of content and want to see more, please leave a follow, do whatever you guys want to do. And until next time, I'll see y'all mates next time. Bye for now.